Hey, hello everybody and welcome to this Let's Play of Necropolis with your host Julius the Wolf. So last time we continued the trend that we were starting. We're making progress, albeit slowly, uh, but we are making progress in all this. A scroll of identification. Uh, you know what, might as well just use it on the one portion we have just to make sure that we've got it exactly the way that we want to identify it. Uh, da, 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 da. Yep, it's it's the mystical restoration. It's the good shit. We need at least one of those per run to make me feel a little bit better. Now I have not turned off the game since the last time I drank one, so we're not gonna we're not gonna die yet. But at the same time, it's it's one of those it's one of those items where it it's fucked me with the little uh, rules that I didn't know about. For instance, did you know that that uh, that that item doesn't persist between uh, power ons of the game? Cause it don't, and that cost me a run, the very first run that you guys saw. Anyway, the point is, we're in a we're in an all right spot. Just make sure we don't get hit by this rat person, otherwise we're gonna have a very bad time. Shut up! Oh, that one hit kills him. Sweet. Okay, so rats must be weak to arcane. This this pleases me. Okay, take that guy out. How do we do with the rest of this level? That, 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 that kind of depends on today. How are we going to do with the rest of this level? Well, the rest of this level went from being like horrible dungeons and, and catacombs and crypts, and now we are in a forest biome. Like, we're, in the, we're you know, tiptoe through treetops. Smack him. He's dead. Because, you know, level 4 arcane shit does good, does good, uh, good damage against things that are weak to it. These guys don't care about arcane, so we're just gonna smack them with the normal bat with the normal bashy shit. Okay, this is still only level six. I might add, like we are still not at a, at a situation where we feel completely comfortable with everything that's going on, and a large portion of that has to do with just oh well, you know, we're still on level six and it's this hard. We had to deal with two mama spiders like right from the start of this level. It's been three episodes. This episode's three episodes long. And by episode, I mean this level is three episodes long. It's incredible. We just, I would like to just get through here at this point. I'm, I'm getting a little tired of le seeing level six in the upper right hand corner. But at the same time, we kind of need to take our time. Make sure that we don't die anywhere. Because if we do die here, that's it for the run, right? So let's, uh, let's not uh, put ourselves in any shittier situation than we need to be in. In order to make sure that we get the most out of our crap. Hold on. I call shenanigans on half the crap that just happened, but that's fine. Okay, we got a gem in here. Look, back off for a second. You gotta fight him someplace where you can see him better. Stairs are not the place to fight this guy. Okay. Okay, now take him out. Good stuff! Okay. So that's an infected creature. He is now dead. We had to spend some uh, stamina to get there, but you know what? Nothing an iron ration couldn't fix if we have one. And we got several, so... This is good, this is good, this is good. Let's keep going. We missed. Well, it's unsurprising. Those little things are fast. Okay, this is a fairly large and expansive part of the level, it seems. Whoa, what? Where'd you come from? I'd rather you didn't exist. You're now dead, though, so that's fine by me. Okay, who's next? You? You're now dead. Okay, great. Arcane sticks. Gotta love them. This this, uh, this this thing is being tier 4 and being drop offable uh, from the one guy that we found. Nice find. Uh, it's not necessarily early in the game either. This is like the beginning of the late game. And we're getting some late game stuff now to, to actually show for it. So this is this is good. But at the same time, no rat people. Three silver chests. Alright, well I'm expecting some good shit here, game. Some tier 4 armor. A sweet wicked wand. Yeah, I'll, I'll take a fire wand. That's fair. I'm not sure how often I'll be able to use it, but hey, it's a thing. Raider's Garb. We already got some, so what's the second one to us? Nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, and what do we get here? A couple of potions. Zeus Perfect Protection is a good one. And another unknown potion. Still, I think Lapis Primus is probably our best bet in terms of a lot of different things we could be doing. Um... Not much in this bottle. It's just enough for something or other. Okay. How do I look like with a wand? Yeah, pretty sick. That's fine. Um. Oh, it's just a just a dude. Okay. No need to worry. Just go this way. 
Is there anything this way? Nope. Okay, great. Can we jump back up? Nope. All right, well, down we go. Fall damage incoming. Not too much, thankfully, but still, it's enough to, to make me feel like I was a bit of a dumb move. And he's dead. Great. Awesome. Thanks for wigging out, camera. Every time I face rats, it's just a pleasure to have to deal with wigged out rats. Um, this is the way we were from whence we came. So we're going to head right this time. We're going to get out of here. Or at least we're going to start trying to. You know, it's situations like this where you can start to breathe a little bit. And you're like, oh, okay, we're doing fine. We're taking stock of everything that's actually going on in this run. And things are go actually going okay. But at the same time, you can't get too cocky. Right? If you get too cocky, you will die. And it's happened before. Ow! Where'd you come from? Come back here. I'm not done with you yet, sir. Now I'm done with you. Good stuff. We got some metal. I'm not sure what that's going to do for us, to be honest with you. Probably very little, but... Okay, so there's a teleporter. Now, do we have chests this way? I'm pretty sure we do. Okay, we're going to let that guy slide. That's fine. I don't hear anything bad that way. What about this way? Yeah, we've, we've got some bad stuff this way. Nothing I can't handle with this hammer skull basher thing of mine, though. This should be a relatively easy couple of kills. Perfect stuff. What's next? Now we took that damage on purpose, pretty much. Walk up to this guy, smack him twice, and now he's dead. We need some stamina, so do we have a f empty inventory? No. Let's drop this potion of vigor, create some standard rations, use it. Like, we've, we're getting to a point now where our inventory management is one way that we can get to the end of this game. This is fine. Which means that we're going to be taking a little bit more time, making sure we go through our due diligence to make sure that we get to the end of this, because absolutely no run is a guaranteed win. It does not matter how good your weaponry is, how awesome your armor is. There, like, there is a point where you just have to be good enough at this game to win. Exhibit A... Gem eaters and then whatever comes out of these grind crystals. Okay, so that's that asshole dead. And now the grind. The grind, I think, are bad against bashy weapons. Okay. Okay. Back off, back off. Now go and wail on these guys a little bit. Okay, we're, we're growing exhausted. Not good. Still making progress. Go in. Oh. Okay, good kills. Good kills overall. Block. Good stuff. Got another couple of kills. Or at least one kill. And two are very close. This hunter in the back is not my primary concern. He can't be. There we go. Killed off another two. That's fine. Dodge around them a little. Reposition. Don't take the damage. That's fine. Now walk up to this guy and kill him. He's dead. Good play! We did it, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it. Okay, good stuff. Um, using an iron ration here seems silly. So, standard ration. Craft it. Eat it up. I don't see anything bad around me. This is a good sign. Alright, eliminating infected creatures is still one for five. We still have not marked the ground with chalk. Because it takes up resources that we don't want to waste, I guess. Take this guy out. Get some stuff. Mr. Night Knight is not a good enough weapon for us to pick up. Not even close. And we're back out into another forest biome. Okay. Tree forests are potentially fine. They are also potentially very scary. Um, you will have several mama spiders, cryptics, and other things show up for, for no good... Uh, <laughs> For no good reason, like exhibit fucking A right there. So, it's a good thing that we still have our bullets, or bullets, bolutes, bolutes, uh, mystical restoration. Because if we didn't, things could, uh, things could get ugly. Alright, so we just need to duck around this guy, going for Abby, attack immediately afterwards. Duck around this guy, going for Abby, attack immediately afterwards. Duck around this guy, going for Abby, attack immediately afterwards. Duck around this guy. Going for a heavy attack immediately afterwards without getting hit. Shit, duck. Okay, wait for him, wait for them to do something other than the jumpy attack. Boom! We took care of it like a professional. 
Oh god, that feels good. God, that feels good! We did it! Okay, so we can take those guys on. It's just, we gotta play smart. <laughs> and we get, they gotta be on their own. The good news is if there's more than one of them, we can uh, just block and wait for the two of them to kind of kill one another. One, like, eventually they'll hit each other, and they still hit for, like, a ton of damage. So, as so long as one hits the other one at least, like, twice before dying, then uh, things get a little bit easier for us. Okay, so some stuff just fell apart. We have to jump to make this gap here. We did so. Good for us. Jump to make this gap as well. Inugami. Okay. Um, I think they're more or less immune to Arcane. They are not immune to the Skull Basher, though. Down they go. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. What's in here? Chest. We also have another uh, Alchemist. Scroll of Healing. That's potentially very useful. Um, potentially more so than our uh, Iron Rations. Like, honestly, Iron Rations take up too much Torn Flesh for, to, for us to really use. Spring Heal Elixir. Okay. There's not much here I really want. Outside of the potions, but like, we've got enough stuff. I, I could. Hold on. I did not mean to do that. Please, please go away. Look, go back into your box and stop bothering me. Now, iron rations are good, but I have a feeling that we're gonna need to just kind of get to a point where we realize that they're not good enough to keep around. So, you know what? Let's eat one, take the scroll of healing with us that we saw earlier, and then move along. Uh, scroll of healing? I mean, we could just buy a Lapras Primus. You know what? Let's do that instead. We'll keep two food around. But uh, Lapis Primus are just too good not to pick up. They, for 100 gems, they are an exceptional investment. Okay. Jump on down. Jump on down. And jump on down. Good work, us. Okay. Now, wh where's the way out? Do we do we take a left turn at Albuquerque? Key? We shouldn't have. Seems like it. Um, seems like there's several ways to go about this. Skeleton down this way. Let's take him out. Should take one hit. Yep, that's what I thought. I mean, we do have one of the strongest bashing weapons in the game. Come at me, my friend. Mon ami. My dog. My men. That's actually kind of funny that I bring that up. Um, there is a thing. I suppose it's a fad going on in France where thanks to uh, a hip-hop artist from Toulouse... They've got this. They've got a bunch of guys effectively just running around saying "mamen," and it's like you know, there's like the French spelling and everything for it as well. Like there's everything going for it, except it's spelled wrong. And the reason why I know it's spelled wrong is because it's a French dude who's trying to say "my man," like my main man. Okay, he's dead. Fantastic. Look, you need to die next. That leaves just this infected dude. Okay. He's probably infected first, gem eater second, but I still think he's weak to arcane. Good, he's dead. Okay. We might be able to get another one of these uh, jobs done after all, it seems. Anyway, so there's this French hip hop. Ooh, where's the rat? There's a French hip hop artist from Toulouse that likes to say uh, Mamen, like M A N E with an accent with an accent on it. Uh, M E N, like you know, it, it's it's ridiculous, truly. And the only reason why I say it's ridiculous is because it's such a huge Anglicism. Like, it's such an English thing to say. And by English, I mean, like, American thing to say. North American thing to say. Uh, am I being specific enough yet? Anyway. It's such a hugely North American thing to say. And just, oh shit. Okay. We need to be careful here. We have three Lapis Primus. Four of them. Four of them. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna pop one here. It's not the perfect time for it, but it's as perfect as it's gonna get for a little while. And he's dead as well. This is worth it. Absolutely 100% worth the Lapis Primus use. Oh my gosh. Okay, switch to the Ar Arcane Weapon and smack this guy once. Just once. That's all I'll take. He's now dead. Fantastic. Alright, we got what's her name up here now? trying to go for friends? I think not. Dodge it. Like a professional. Smack it. Dodge it. Don't smack it. She left. Dodge it. 
Smack it. She's close enough. Now dodge it. Wait for it. Get your stamina back. Hold on. This is okay. This is fine. You're stronger than the vast majority of bad guys in this game. But you are by no means invulnerable. You are killable. Today you die. Oh, that was a little close. Okay. Don't be that risky. Don't be that risky. Just go for the shit that you know works. Just wait for them to fuck up. Just like that. Yep. That's good. That's good. That's very good. Okay. Whoo-wee. Another uh, recipe for a potion of vigor. That's exactly what I needed. Thanks. It's not like I didn't pay money for that, like, somewhere near the beginning of this run. Holy shit, this level is still not done, and we're nearing the end of another episode. Good lord. Alright, what's down this way? No idea. There, there could be just, like, more chests and more stuff. That'd be my guess. Alright. Hello, Mr. Hunter? Excuse me, you were too far away? Let's try that again. Thank you. Okay, anything over here? No, there's a wall. But I don't hear any secret walls that came out of it, so... That's that. Okay, we gotta go over here then. Or this... We're, we'll, we will go over here. And there's this hunter over here that we can take out. He should be relatively easy. Oh, shit. They got a rat, too. Okay, we're gonna switch to this rat. Because we can kill him in one hit. Whoa, hold on. Good, good block. I don't know how I did it, but that that, that, that that worked. Okay, now take out this guy. Good stuff. We did not mean to attack three times. We panicked a little. That's fine. We haven't panicked using attacks in a little while, so, you know, it was about to happen at some point. Oh, another one of these assholes, huh? Piff. Okay. He's dead. Now we are back here. Okay, we will head up this time. This seems to have worked out in our favor. We get some chests. Good stuff. Alright, what are we going to find in these chests? And then after that, we'll call it an episode. Pick up an unknown potion. We don't know what it is, so fuck it. It's also a level 1 potion, so it's definitely not good enough. Lapis Primus we pick up for sure. Uh, okay, a little bit of metal. I don't really care about that. And by door number 3, we get a really sick, sweet greatsword. It's unfortunately not what we want right now. We need the Bashi weapon too much. Like, the, the mama the mama cryptics are just too big not to, so... We, we gotta stick with what we got. Anyway, what we got is still pretty good. But, uh, we're gonna have to stop here for the end of the episode. Thank you everybody so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. If you did, be sure to let me know. Hit that like button down below, and I'll see you guys in the next video.